Dear soul, thank you for being here. I appreciate you investing your time here with me. My intention is that you get tons of value back for your time spent here. Now buckle up. These affirmations are powerful. If you want to, imagine that they are yours. I am combining the power of my will, my heart, my spirit to make empowering changes in my life. Where I spend my time and attention, I spend my soul's currency, my life force. My life force is precious. From now on, I am investing my time and attention wisely, concentrating my creational fire into essential matters. I am honing my ability to concentrate and focus. I am concentrating my willpower like the sun concentrated through a magnifying glass, creating fire in an instant. I use my inner fire, my creational energy, to make things happen. That's right. I am sculpting my life with intention, intuition, discernment, and concentrated effort. I don't sell my soul to please others or to fit in. I stand courageously on my own two feet, grounded, calm. Authentic. Authentic. I am the willpower, intuition, and creative drive that can overcome any challenge. Solutions reveal themselves when I take action towards them like looking up at the sky at night. First, only a few stars seem to be visible. But as I focus my attention on the stars, more and more stars appear. They were there all along, just as solutions are. Courage is a choice. It doesn't come on a silver platter. It has to be chosen. I am choosing courage despite fear. I am taking time to rest, recharge and enjoy life. I am consciously creating more enjoyment and fun in my life. And I have to make an effort to make that happen. Not easy? No. But possible. I am awareness. I am aliveness. I am love. I am consciousness. I am consciousness. I am here. I am here. I am here. Distractions seem to be fighting for my time and attention. Huh. Many of them are kept alive because of the time and attention I have given them. All those hours of wasting my soul's currency on these distractions. No more. 
Enough is enough. I draw the line in the sand. Now. I am canceling my membership at the Self Sabotage Club. It's too time consuming, way too expensive, way too draining. I'm walking out right now. Bye. I choose to smile more. I'm smiling now. I choose to laugh more and play more. Frowning doesn't look good on anyone. Pouting sours my mind, my body and soul. So why bother? Not all days are good days, though, and that's okay. I'm a human. For me to move through these days, I might feel the need to vent my issues and complaints to someone that can really listen, or vent to myself out loud in front of a mirror. Other times, I need time for myself to recharge, take it easy and relax. Or find solutions to challenges. While many times, I probably just need to tell that negative committee in my head to sit down and shut up. I guard the gates of my mind. Not everything is worth my time and attention. Far from it. Prioritizing self-care because I care. I am consciously taking charge of my time and attention. I stop wasting it away now. I sharpen my sword of attention. Discernment and concentration. I am the light of awareness. I am the light of consciousness. I am vigilant. I have to be if I want to stay focused, empowered, positive, caring. With focused attention, I am making high-quality decisions. No bullshit. From the eagle's perspective, I observe, I listen, I see, I breathe. I am decisive, tenacious, and brave. I live with integrity and authenticity. Avoiding making a decision is also a decision, a draining one. Making decisions empowers me, and I choose to honor and respect myself. Every single decision I make affects my life now and in the future. If I need support in making those tough decisions, I ask for it. Simple, just like that. I am open to receiving support, kindness, and love. I deserve all of that. With assertiveness, discernment, and care, I choose to follow through on those tough decisions. Now, I follow through, and I choose to honor and respect myself. I am concentrating my time, energy, and attention into creating a high. Quality life. 
I hereby take full ownership and responsibility for myself and my journey now. Laziness bores me. Being productive about the right things enlivens me. My willpower, combined with discernment, intuition, and wisdom, is my super power. I am enjoying taking action that uplifts, balances, and empowers myself and others. Thinking, meditating, affirming is not enough. Action is key. I am transmuting the energy of procrastination into an eternal flame of determination and commitment to live my life fully. Will all days be good days? Nope. Will I do my best on the not so good days? Yes, I will. I learn from the journey. For every decision I make and every step I take, I learn, grow, and become better. I am authentic, honest, and caring in everything I do. I am choosing to engage in activities that uplift and support myself and others. If it's not supportive, why bother? My path is my responsibility. I embrace it and I honor it. I am the owner of my life. Today and the days to come, I choose to do my best to be the best version of myself that I can. I choose to respect myself no matter what's happened in the past. This is the moment that I am alive. This is the moment where I can create. This is the moment where I can move on up to me. I am ready to face life. I am one with the love, power, and wisdom of my spirit. Hear, see, and feel me soar.